here and today we're playing life is strange before the storm and this is remastered by the way guys Hey Nathan bro, welcome to the stream dude. How do I do that bro? Um... How do I do that? Go to settings and go to music. You mean this? You mean this, yeah? And what, what do I do? Just turn the music down a bit. How far should I turn it down? Oh, just mute music, okay. Yeah, I did it. You see me do it, right? I can't believe Firewalk is playing a show at the old mill. Fuck yes. Mom would kill me if she knew I was out here. Yeah, dude. No trespassing? No way. Hmm. Hey, Frigus. Welcome. Holy shit. <laughs> How are you, Nanook? <laughs> this place is awesome. If I'm going to get inside, I'll have to get through that door. You're always blaming everyone else but yourself. If I owed somebody a thousand dollars, I'd be shitting my pants. Mmm, what did you have? Some say the world will end in fire. <laughs> Mom would totally flip her shit if she knew I hiked for an hour just to see a show. Your problem. Not mine. I know you're kind. Some in state. Mm. Very nice. Very nice. Or not. Hmm. Damn. Mind your own. Hey Rezzy. Welcome to the stream, Rezzy. This RV's just begging for a little street art. But if I do it here, someone will see me. Mm -hmm. Ah, perfect place for me to work. Now what to draw? Hmm, free candy.
Hey kids, free candy. Yes, free candy. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, officer. It says what on the side of my RV? This place has collected a lot of junk over the years. I'd join a motorcycle gang if I had any friends. <laughs> Kidnapping. Mm -hmm. That saw looks ancient. I wonder how long ago the mill an old lumber car. Guess it's been years since anyone's actually worked here. Come on, kids, there's free candy in the van. Yeah, imagine. I've got to figure out how to get mm. past this guy. Help you, miss. You gotta let me in. Check it. I'm totally legit. It's not a bad fake, kid. But you're in over your head here. Do yourself a favor and scram. Really? Did you have to chuck it back at me, though? Hmm. Can't let him push me around. Should I go back? Nothing says badass like a nice floral print. I'd join a motorcycle gang, if I had any friends. God, again? What do you want? <laughs> Wait, hang on. Hey Buzzer. Hey, I'm just streaming right now. Hmm. How are you? I don't know, because as I say, I'm uh, trying to lean it against. No, I was trying trying to lean it against my door, but I can't seem to do that. No. It... Yeah, because I'm just streaming right now as well. <laughs> This is the old mill, right? Yeah. I heard Firewalk is playing here tonight. If you want, They're if you want to, awesome. yeah. If you want to join, you can do. I was actually leaving my kidding? phone on charge, so I'm just going to charge my phone, okay? Okay, well, uh, I mean, like, Dave, you want to say hi to you? Mm -hmm. Hi. <laughs> Bless you. <laughs> I'll see you, see you soon, Daisy. <laughs> bye bye. Bye bye. Tickle tickle. <laughs> Sorry guys. Sorry. Is that your bike over there? Yep. Uh, pretty cool. Gee, thanks. Is that all? I'm just also sh uh, showing out the stream as well. Hi Daisy! Tickle 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 tickle! Hmm. Hi Daisy! Hmm. Hang on, hang on guys, sorry. No, okay. Okay, I've done it. Okay. Laughing. <laughs> I have to convince this doorstop that I'm not giving up until he lets mm. me inside. Don't 
Don't you remember what it's like to be a teenager? I just want to see the band. I thought we went over this. Mm -hmm. Is it past your bedtime? Really? Bedtime, okay. Oh, isn't it past your Bless you. Bless you, Daisy. Real cute. Mm. But I still don't know you. Real cute. <laughs> look at my face. Do I look cute? Hmm. Or do I look like I'm going to kick your ass? <laughs> okay, kid. I get it. You're tough. I am not a damn kid. Other things I'm not. Young lady, <laughs> kiddo, chica, sweet cakes. A girl like you? I can't protect you in there. <laughs> a girl like you with pretty, pretty flowers on her bicycle <laughs> shouldn't lecture me on what I can Yes, do. go, Thanks, Chloe. Go, so Chloe. <laughs> <laughs> Look, my boss decides who gets in, all right? Just look the other way. No one will know. Besides, people love me. I'm funny. Around here, funny people have a way of getting hurt. Dude, relax already. Damn. You're flexing so hard, you're going to pop. Keep pushing me. See where it gets you. Oh, hey, Bowser called. He wants his jewelry back. You're, you're not accepting no for an answer, are you? Nope. <laughs> and you really think you can take me? Yep. What if I had a knife? No problem. A gun? Don't care. What if I had... You could have a flamethrower, an army of robot ninjas, and a motherfucking dragon on a leash in there, and I'd still <laughs> kick your ass. <laughs> I give up. <laughs> you're all right, kid. Go on in. Yay. We got in, guys. We got in. This is intense. <laughs> Shit. Hey, Delia, come. <laughs> Cute dog. Thank you, uh, thank you, Frigus. Thank you. Just follow the lights and the sound. Can't wait to get in there and th that dog is fierce. What's her name? Delia. Hello, Delia. She doesn't usually like people. Yeah. Me neither. <laughs> Sober up, girl. You're missing the show. Damon Merrick again? Hmm. Who is this guy? Sketch Central. I can't hear you. Can you talk louder, please? Sweet knife. Just like the one my mom hmm. refused to get me for my birthday. Yeah, I mean... Cold beer, free for the taking. Yes. Drink more, feel less. Yes, please. Graffiti everywhere. I Evil eye. Hmm. What are you looking at? Hmm. Hmm. 
That's totally me in five beers. <laughs> okay, three. How can you just chill when Firewalk is tearing it up in the next room? <laughs> oh my god, yeah. Frank Bowers? What is he doing here? Yo, Frank! Hey! Chloe? I know your name, you idiot. You bought pot for me every month for a year. Look at that get up, <laughs> studs. You're trying too hard. What are you even doing here? I'm here to see Firewalk, man. They rock. How'd you even hear about this little shindig? God, the internet. <laughs> How else? Seriously? Fucking kids. So, you come here a lot, or...? Yeah. Right. It's cool. I'm really glad you approve. Okay, so you holding? I could definitely use something to take the edge off. Of course. As soon as you give me the 175 bucks you owe me. Shit. Do I really owe him that much? Unless I find some quick cash around here, I can kiss my high goodbye. How about you spot me some? You know I'm good for it. <laughs> no way. I learned my lesson last time. Money first. Never mind, then. <sighs> Suit yourself. <laughs> no thanks. I try to avoid hepatitis when I can. Classy. Half those stairs are rotted through. Looks dicey. You wash. I can't hear you. Can you talk louder, please? How how are you doing? Looks like that parking brake is the only thing keeping that car from rolling down the ramp. No. No, no, no. Yeah. No shit. This car could slide down any minute. That shirt is rad. No. No, 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 no. Look, we have to set this up exactly Is that guy as selling merch? All right. It... Hey. Are you selling 20 any bucks? What? 20 bucks for a t-shirt. That's really expensive. Dick. No. No, 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 no. Look, we have to set this up exactly as I've explained. Hey, I told you 20 bucks. You looking to get beat? That guy's a dick. If I want a shirt, I'm going hmm. to need to get creative. No. no, 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 no. Look, we have to set this up exactly as I've explained it to you. All right? Sorry, dude. Maybe you shouldn't overcharge. Shit! No, 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 no! Come on! Thanks for playing, Dick. I'm chilling. Ah, oh, good, good. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Sweet, sweet victory. Again. Hang on. Well, what do you think I should do? Nanook, should I steal the money or leave it? You're being a bad girl, Keith. So should I leave the money and be the good girl? Yes, money. <laughs> Holy shit! I'm rich! Woohoo! <laughs> Nothing sadder than a neglected mm. bong.
such a criminal. That's she me. Turns. About that weed. Uh, here it comes. Toss in a dime bag and we'll call it square. Hey, hey! What are you waving around this kind of money here for? You really don't think before you act, do you? Nope. So, where's my pot? No more loans. I'm not your fucking piggy bank. You're a good man, Frank. No. I'm not. I'll beat it, Price. You're cramping my style. <laughs> I'll see you later. Whatever. That dog is fierce. There are a lot of people here. Here we go. No. No, I haven't. No. Not this one. Hey. You okay? I'm fine. Relax. You bumped into me, remember? Yep, my bad, dude. You don't know who I am, do you? Nope. Don't care either. Hey, let me know how that works out for you, bitch. All right, mosh pit is a no go. Fine. Maybe I can get a better view of the action from up above. If I want to see the band, I'll have to find another way. Those guys are trouble. Hmm. Hey Lee, how you doing? How you doing, buddy? Ah, oh, hey Nick, how you doing? Oh, yes! Finally how you doing, it. buddy? All good. Oh, that's good. I'm glad to hear that. <laughs> yeah, I'm doing good. I'm doing good, Nick. I will be playing more with the quarry soon, if you want to stop by. My beer, bitch. You should be more careful. It's a rough place. I don't like your attitude. Then how about I show you how unimpressed I mm. am with limp dick? Yeah, this is the remastered. Over a spilled beer. I think I got, she's calling us out, dude. She's I got gonna the regret remastered. every word. Every word. Oh, this is gonna be good. I'm gonna teach this little punk some man. I'm serious. You wanna see me get angry here? Because I'm getting there. And it won't be pretty. It won't. She thinks she can take you? Hey, dickhead. Yes, attack him. Get off me. Rachel? Come on. Hurry up. Let me go, Frank. Not going to happen. Calm down. Come on, man! Walk away! Screw Wait, this! Lamba. Yes. This is bullshit. Get the fuck out of here! Uh, 
I did turn the music off, by the way, guys, so I don't get the copyrighted. That's why you can't hear it. Thank you. Do you want me to turn up maybe a little low? You don't have to. Okay, Nick, thank you. I think it's good the way it is. Mm. Sometimes all I want to do with daily rituals are important. Hey, Max. Hey, Dad. Another day in paradise. Mm. Right? That's Max. Chloe! Wakey, 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 wakey! <laughs> Last night, seeing Firewalk live, the skeevy assholes, that girl. I Was did. That really, Rachel Amber? I did play on the old PlayStation, yeah. You smell like cigarettes and beer. Better ch One of these days, I'm actually going to use you to do my homework. Ask Miss Arcadia. You're hmm. the only source of info I trust in this town. Wait, what? Who? What photo? I have feelings about this. Most of them are not good feelings. Hmm. That really was Rachel Amber. And she saved my life. How was last night even real? I'd like to think my humor has improved with age. Really? Oh, no. I'm perfectly capable of waking up without you, you know. Eventually. What? So I should be okay I because he was playing the music, or...? It's the only mode of transportation that doubles as a middle finger to authority. I bet long Max Silver traded her hat for beer and boot. Nice one, Chloe. Mom's gonna love the new look. Mom said I was too young to go. She was wrong. And it was... As awesome as some of those shows with Elliot were, they were nothing compared to Firewalk last night. Max made me this mix CD years ago. And because it was Max, not a single song was pirated. Fun fact. But I Shark turned the music. Their siblings in the womb. Maybe that's why I used to dream of riding a unicorn as a kid. But then all the unicorns died. No more unicorns, no more princesses, and no more fucking rainbows. 
Words of wisdom, don't fail me now. 100% of the shots. <laughs> yeah. Everything's yes. worth a shot. You miss 100% of the shots you don't drink. <laughs> Man, I am killing it this year. Somehow, I don't think Mom's going to feel the same way. Yeah, no one needs to see that. Thank you. Better living through chemistry. Wake and bake is part of a healthy breakfast. Let's put firewalk on. Yeah, dude. Can't leave without my vitamins. <laughs> she calls them drugs. Uh, I really should get going. Shit. Where's my phone? God, it's not here. How drunk was I last night? Chloe, I said breakfast. Guess I better try calling my phone with mom's. Okay. Mom's phone is probably in her room. I can use it to call mine, then home sweet home. Whoever said you can't go home again <laughs> was probably from Arcadia Bay. And he could go home again. Yeah, where's, um, where's Criminal been at lately, uh, Nanook? And Nick, um, I will, as I said, I will be doing the Mom's quality. Mom's her gray hair to you know. impress her boyfriend. Maybe gray hair's his kryptonite. Maybe I should the preferred towel of Captain Bluebeard, scourge of Arcadia Bay. I hate that she hides all our old pictures of Dad. Uh, I see. I'll drop by when I can. Uh, okay, Nick. Thank you. Can you message Ashes and let him know that I'm live? Um, like Nick, I know he may be at work, but can you just drop my link to him? I made this for mom when I was like 10 years old. If she wore it now, can't believe I used to sneak in there for her makeup. Mom's old engagement ring. Grade B? Fuck you, Arcadia Pawn. Wait, Mom's selling her engagement ring? Thank you, Nick. Thank you. Mom's finally making her bed again? I guess that's a good sign. I want Mom to be happy, but... Sometimes you have to get knocked down lower than you've ever been to stand up taller than you ever were. Blech. Don't give up on yourself. A single spark can start a fire that burns the entire prairie. Better.
It's weird that mom's always hoarding these old catalogs. It's not like we have any money. Ah, mom. Bad enough that David comes here for dinner. I should call my phone. How can mom look at this every day and not see what a tool she's dating? Well, oh, thank you. Thank you. Welcome back, Nick. Sounds like my phone is definitely nearby. There we go. Wonder how many calls I've missed. Chloe, breakfast. Bring my purse down with you, please. Yeah, yeah, okay. I think I saw Mom's purse in her room. Oh, can you grab my cell phone, too? No more dawdling. I need to talk to you. Yeah. Okay. That really makes me want to hurry. Life is indeed strange, yes. Coming, Mom. Is that Connor I see? No, Connor isn't in this game. <laughs> Finally, you can put my purse on the dining table. You might still have time for breakfast if you hurry. Chloe, you mean Chloe? Dining table, here I come. Dad took these photos. Now that David's staying over so much, I wonder how long it'll take Mom to shove them in a drawer somewhere. My profile picture. Ah, uh, okay, sorry. Any letter from the <laughs> Sorry, I didn't know. Good. I didn't know that you meant that, sorry. Mom doesn't want me to know, but it's pretty clear her... Is Mom having trouble with payments again? My scholarship doesn't cover everything. <sighs> like I need another reason for principal... Aren't you glad you left for Seattle, Max? <sighs> and never looked back? from when Max and I spilled Mom's wine. I think the only reason Mom hasn't recarpeted is so she- We're already supporting one. Thanks. When it's I my job to water these plants, do, I'm gonna ditch, um... It was Dad's job to rem Made that for Mom in an art class when I was like five. I I'm gonna- She's never a smoker, but it's cool. Uh, do that. I was never an artist. Wait, those aren't Mom's keys. Thank and you. these would be David's keys. There's probably a better place for them than the ashtray. Feeling trapped? Mm -hmm. Right there with you. Thank you, uh, High Dusk. <laughs> Little dude's like, what the hell just happened? Shoot. I was hoping David could get a job on a container ship. To Japan. Why do I- This is Principal Ray Wells. Let me be in Haven't really felt like sitting down to eat since David start- Chloe, I don't have all day. Would you get over here already? I should see what Mom wants before she strokes out. Dad's old swear jar. We spent the last of his curses on bus fare and milk. How can bacon smell so good, but I'd still rather stuff these sugar bombs in my mouth? It's not that I'm ungrateful. It's just that Joyce Price, AKA mom, she looks as mm. beat as I feel. Hey mom, you wanted to talk? 
Chloe, what happened to you? It's no big deal. Huh. I walked into a door. Detroit to be bottom into a become. <laughs> When I send you a text message, Chloe, like last night, I need you to answer. You can just say text. You don't have to say message. And I need you to answer without the snark. Sorry. I hear you. I'll do better about replying. Thank you. Is that what you wanted to talk about? What is it with you and David? Always cutting to the chase. Why can't we just have some pleasant conversation before school? Are you selling your engagement ring? Chloe, jewelry gets appraised for all sorts of reasons. Like for insurance. Nice dodge. How about this? You don't go in my bedroom when I'm not there. How about you don't ask me to get your damn purse then? You do realize I hate your boyfriend with every fiber of my being, right? <laughs> Chloe! You don't hate He calls me girly. He's a dickhole. He can be old-fashioned. Yeah, an old-fashioned dickhole. <laughs> oh, dear. Ah, right. <clears throat> School. My favorite. You used to love to learn. Yeah. I used to think drugs were lame, too. I wish you wouldn't judge. Hello, me. Laura. How what, how months. are you? I made you breakfast. Nah, I'll just grab something later. Oh, you'll enjoy this. The other day I made how eggs how are you, Laura? Two for me, and just before I served them, he says, "What are you gonna eat?" <laughs> I'll enjoy that, huh? Firewalk? Is that the band you mentioned last week? I'm still bummed you wouldn't let me go. Mm-hmm. What? Yeah, I'm, I'm okay, Laura. I'm okay. And don't think you can get out of school just because you missed I'm doing the okay, Why thank you. you that... Who do you think your principal calls when you skip? Do you think I enjoy lying for you? Thank Same you for the nine likes, so by the way, spend. guys. Do you think we can reach ten? Ten likes or maybe even fifteen, guys? Between your grades mm. and your disregard for my rules, I see you slipping. I'm worried. But, Mom, the whole point of lowering expectations is so you won't be disappointed in me. Ever again. You're happy doing what you're doing? Fine. Keep at it. Just let me know so I can stop fighting with Blackwell to keep you on scholarship. Money's tight enough as it is. Maybe David should start yeah, paying rent. Shoo. He spends the night often enough. How would you know? You're never That's here That's true. That's true. David thinks you need discipline. David should mind his own business. I think it's great David's taking an interest. He's a Thank you, man. Laura. Thank you. Maybe he can help. Thank you so much. Dad was a good man. That's not fair. I'm <laughs> glad your father still has a place in your heart. But sometimes we need to make more room in our hearts for new people. And sometimes, when we're incredibly desperate and lonely, we choose the absolute wrong kind of people to let into our hearts. Yeah, Mom. thank you. Thank you for, David's you know. David's had some hard times too, you know. If he's kind enough to share his experience, I expect you to listen. Like I'd let him get within 15 feet of me. <laughs> when he takes you to school today. Very funny. Hi, Dusk. Uh, you will be nice. Let me add you as a moderator. And you will say thank oh, you. Oh, nice. You if you want to drop your link, you can do. This is such what, Chloe? Such you, what? You can, you can do <sighs> if you want. Trying, I guess. Maybe I should, too. But what's the point in getting along if it means pretending everything's fine when it's not? You want me to pretend I'm okay with David? That everything's okay? I'm not. He's a chauvinistic piece of shit, frankly, Chloe, and... if your father could hear you... No, you're right. I'm sure Dad and the mustache would get along great. 
It's a big bed. There's room enough for all three of you. That's enough. All I'm asking for is a little respect. Why is that too much? I love you, Chloe. I miss you. Nobody could have replaced her father. I did the best I could. Mom. I don't know where I lost you. You didn't lose me. Right. David's way if you want to drop your link, feel free to, uh... Go be his problem now. Bringing David his keys Feel free is to, the um, most humiliating thing Mom could ask me drop, to do. Drop your link, by the way. Yeah, your channel link, yeah. Yeah, leave your channel link. Oh, God, no, 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 no. I made that ashtray for mom's keys only. Mm. Sorry guys, I'm just uh Hey Buggy, hey bro. How how you doing? Sorry. I'm just uh Replying to a message, guys. David can't leave our house without his keys. I better get them to him. Stat. Oh my god. Okay, I've just got to force myself. David's keys in the ashtray. Yes, give me a second. Yeah, yeah, everything's fine, Laura. Hey, uh, hey, uh, Al Alia. I made that ashtray for mom's keys only. Oh my god, I can't believe it. Yes, thank you. Sorry guys, I just uh Guess David likes hmm. pot roast. Guess we're all about what David wants. I was just replying to a message. Sorry guys.
No point in putting off the inevitable torture of driving to school with David. They'd better get going. He was texting me, bless him. <laughs> yes, I was, yes. What a piece of crap. The car, too. Why do you women always take forever to get ready? We're hoping you men will leave without us. It's okay. I understand. No, Mom. I understand. I swear he beat himself mm. to death with a tire iron. Repeatedly. You know, if people are here, which I appreciate, you Is know. Is that a black eye? No. Insubordination. No wonder your mother's worried about you. Oh, that's sweet. When I was your age, I got into my share of scraps. But it's not responsible. You owe it to your mother to do better. Tell me again what I owe my mother, dirtbag. Electrode insulators probably cracked. Hey, Richard. You know what hey. a spark plug does? Hmm. Yes. It ignites. Did you not hear me? I said I know what it no, does. No, not today. Then go grab my socket wrench set from the garage, and we can get moving. Not what today, is this? anyway. Quality time. Ugh. Better just get the socket wrench and get this over with. Mom should date literally anyone else. Where's the socket wrench set again? All I see in the garage is family stuff. You know, not your stuff. Dick around on your own time. It's in the toolbox, in the garage. Weekdays, I mean, you know, I'm busy tomorrow. Ah, oh, okay. <laughs> Tiniest penis in all of Arcadia Bay. What's David doing, leaving stuff in our garage anyway? Does he think he's moving in or something? Yeah, I don't care. Just get rid of them. Just get, just get rid of them, that's what I say, you know. Should fill this with gasoline just in case David's car ever catches on fire. Damn. The stereo used to be in Dad's workshop. I should hook it up in my room before Dad's old camera. <laughs> Do they even make film for these anymore? No, just hide hide them. Uh oh, Mom's been cleaning again. Uh, uh, this used hide to hang them. in the living room. Guess it's ancient just history now. Don't turn them out. Just remove them. David's lawnmower. Maybe Mom and I like our lawn the way it is. Ever think of that? Do these have chapters on hot wiring your mom's boyfriend's car so you can buy toolbox? Did David mean this or did he? <laughs> There's his stupid socket wrench set. 50 50 chance I smash him in the face with this. 60 40. Maybe 90 10. Uh, yeah, but it probably won't be till later. Like, uh... Dad's toolbox. You know. He used to get so excited whenever anything sprung a leak or busted. If it's in my garage, it gets my special treatment. What message does David really need to hear? <laughs> Box of <Got> it. dicks. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> uh no worries. As Tiny I say, it'll be probably Bay. around five, six o'clock tomorrow. I'll 
little more hustle wouldn't have killed you. Yeah, I just ignore them. See what's gunking up the works there? That's a sign of carbon, carbon deposits. Oil. No shit. You know, you could actually be good at this if you lost the attitude. My attitude is what makes me special, David. All right. How you do anything is how you do everything. Now I need a shower. <laughs> now I need a shower. Hey, you're taking those tools with you, right? Every house needs a good toolbox. <sighs> We've already got one, but thanks. That's true. That's true, uh... That's true. Hmm. They're just, uh, they're just giving me the watch time and views. This is what I said. Please don't want to talk. I want to talk to you about something. Fuck. We don't have to like each other, but you will respect me. You've enjoyed enough. Yeah, I do as well. I got on with my stepdad too. Things I want to be real clear about. Respect him? I think it's time I show this asshole I'm not interested in anything he has to say. What's clear is fuck you. Language. You are way out of line, young lady. Language? Here, let me put that in a language you'll understand. Foxtrot. Uniform. You've got a smart mouth, don't you? Let me dumb it down for you. I mean, sorry. What has fewer syllables than dumb? Hey, watch your... I can crap bigger than you, got it? Oh, that's what I smell. A giant load of crap. You... Your mother... You're breaking her heart. Leave mom out of this. This is about you. Oh, and I'm me, sorry. And you being an asshole. I'm sorry. Uh... I was in the army. You will respect me. You're not my father. You're not even on the same planet as my father. My job is to make sure you and your mother have a safe and peaceful home. Thank you. Do I come to your place of employment? Thank you, Dad. Oh. That's right. You don't have one. If you were a man, I It's I'd... cool. If you were a man, I wouldn't go so easy on you either. Don't know why I bother trying. <laughs> Mission accomplished. Because <laughs> <laughs> of nuts. <laughs> Country music. I'm really sorry. I'm really sorry, uh, guys. I just called to tell you that I miss you, my old friend. What a beautiful day. This... This isn't right. Thank you. Thank you, Cosmo. Thank you, uh... 
for that. If mom were here, she'd tell him to turn that junk off. I know what a spark plug does, jerkwad. <laughs> hmm. Dad, turn it up. Picking up my lover from the grocery store. store. Do you guys want me to do two episodes today? Uh, well, yeah, I hope so too. If you want, okay. I will. I'll um. The hell? Out of the car, Chloe. You're gonna be late. Whatever. You're welcome. Okay. Uh. Okay. High desk. Okay, feel free to pop back if you can, okay? Hello, Black Hell. Hmm. Hey, Chloe. Oh, hey, Elliot. Wait, what happened to your face? Do you need to go to the nurse or something? What? Yes. <laughs> you should see the other guy. Guess it's true then. I heard you had a hell of a night. I mean, people are talking about it. People can eat a dick. Even social media haters can't ruin how awesome last night was. So, how about the Tempest? Blackwell Theater at its most pretentious. Yeah, <laughs> totally. I know it's gonna be lame, but I was thinking... Do you want to go together tomorrow? Uh, sure, maybe. I try to make it a rule not to go to school any more than I have to. Right, sitting in the back row and making fun of the drama kids might not suck. Right? That's totally what I was thinking. All right. See you in Cam. Yeah, for sure. Who's uh who's going to stop for the whole stream, guys? Who you know? Got to track down Steph to pick up my DVD. I've still got meh. Well, at least not for now. Maybe this play won't suck. Maybe. How could I possibly make it through a day in this place without a little chemical assistance? Ah, oh, thank you, Fergus. Thank you. Th uh, thank you uh, so much. Damn, girl, that eye looks sick. What's going on? Last night, I scoped out this crazy party at the old mill up north. Oh, thank you, kind Nick. Of a DIY thing? Wow, no shit. I'll watch until Harry like starts. I don't central. know if he's going to be like streaming or not, Richard. There. Whatever. Um, it was cool, okay? I don't you think he'll understand. be streaming tonight, uh, hey, Richard. Out of the blue question. What do you think of Rachel Amber? She is amazing. Uh, if you're into chicks that are hot, smart, and hot. <laughs> I mean, she helped me out a while back. I was failing algebra hard. I believe you. 
Check it. After I bombed my midterm last fall, she tutored me for the rest of the semester. And then I crushed it. C plus. Huh. All right. Guess I'll see you in class. Word. I know it's now. Yeah, yeah, he does. He does indeed, yes. Yes, he does. He does have a PS5, yes. He's not... Hey, Skip. Stopped any gang wars lately? Not today. Oof. Looks like you did, though. Huh? Ah, right. Whatever. I did ask Justin Williams' mom to move her Mercedes out of handicapped parking. That ass. Yeah, you know how I roll. Yeah, I'm, uh... <laughs> I've I've been so, playing on PS5 too. Time with Justin's mom. <laughs> no. But if you see Justin, I'm I'm playing on PS5 too. Uh, guys. So tell him yourself, Skip. Not my problem. I'm trying to do him a favor. Speaking of doing people favors. Uh, yeah. Guess I've been hanging around Justin this morning. Mm -hmm. His odor must have latched onto me. Uh huh. Yes. Glad to see all you high risks sticking together. But it took high it risks? took me two years oh, to get shit. it. Sorry, forget I called you that. It took huh. me two. High risks. Guess you can learn useful things in school. So I went to the mill last night, cut firewalk live. Yeah, I can see that. Wait, you went to the mill last night? It was cool. Whoa, pretty wicked. I didn't know you were into music like that. Really? You can't judge a girl by the elitist fascist school her mother makes her go to, you know? Yes, a PS5, <laughs> yes. Have you got I'm a PS5? A fan, yes. Actually. No shit. Really? We're called Pisshead. It's hmm. not a big deal or anything. I mean, I mean, I'm trying to get our demo out there, but it's hard. Pisshead, huh? W would you maybe want to hear it? Our demo, I, I mean. I really gotta go, Skip. Maybe another time. Oh yeah, no big deal. F of course, another time's better. Cool. Well, th thanks anyway, Chloe. Sure. Morning, Miss Grant. Chloe, are you all right? Yeah, I'm fine. Hmm. What do you think of this hypothesis? That you'll be in your seat. By Nick, the time of um, class I forgot to ask. Today. Do you stream, by the way? Science is all about I just forget. Do you Grant? stream? Guess you'll have to wait and see. With all the change. Oh, Richard, let me well make away. you back a moderator. I suppose I can appreciate your um, win, Let me put one what for you too. Uh, well. The Prescotts have made an extremely generous donation to the school, which is good. But instead of going to support more science and mathematics, I forgot. It's does Nick does Nick stream? The arts. You don't think more money should be spent in the arts? It's not that exactly. I recently made the case that STEM programs should receive more support, but apparently our new donors disagree with me. Oh, such is life. I suppose. Why well, you've uh, just gone to your sad. channel, Nick, and I'm not uh, and I'm not followed to you. Look at it this way, Miss Grant. More art classes will keep like, all I followed you, so when you do stream, I'm followed. Articulate as always. Hmm. Yeah, I made you. I made you both moderators, um, Richard and uh, Alia. Uh, but fine. 
fire's so pretty. Oh, no worries. No worries. Students at Blackwell have this herd instinct to glom up into little groups, like sheep. And if you just want to be alone, you get labeled like some dangerous outsider. Hang on. Sorry for what? What do you mean, sorry? Need my DVD from Steph. I bet she's nerding it up with Mikey, so... It's okay. It's okay, I uh... probably be getting to class, but... Mm, I figures. just don't care. In case you missed her and... Oh yeah, I heard you. I heard you. I did answer. I did answer, um... Principal Wells. Hey. Stay cool, Corey. <laughs> I understand. Don't be. In your Chloe Price. Is that a black eye? I'm... Uh, yep. I hope you know that Blackwell provides mm -hmm. confidential counseling services for all our students. We are a safe space for any issue. I'm good. It's the other guy who needed a safe space. From me. You never fail to conform to your reputation, do you? Miss Price, the sign clearly says do not walk on the stage. No, Such no. disregard for your fellow students' efforts. No, I did. I did uh, say that I followed you, so... How many minor infractions and mm -hmm. in a major one? This is no joke, Miss Price. Who's joking? You've seen my math grades. Perhaps you will find me less amusing if I mention the various mm -hmm. allegations I've been hearing about your drug use. You know Blackwell has a zero tolerance policy. And yet if my olfactory sense does not fail me, I'd say you've recently been exposed to marijuana smoke. Shit. Do I have to initiate a search of your person in order to establish the veracity of these allegations, Miss Price? That's what I thought. I'll look forward to seeing you in my office after school today. How does that sound? Wells really has it out for me. I have to convince him it's in his best interest to back off. Actually, sir... I'm gonna go with no. Ah, so you're going to mouth off to me now. I'm yes? so sorry, I've Here got a I bad headache. Ah, well, well run dry. you're okay to stay. Sir, my well of witticism You're okay to so stay, you know. Would get trapped at the bottom, but if you don't want to talk, if you just want to chill, then that's fine with me. Jokes, hmm. in my experience. That's how the guilty cover up their infractions. Sorry, Wellesley, but you've fallen right into my trap. I've been recording this entire conversation from my blog about human rights abuses at Blackwell. You have a blog. Hold on. What abuses have you endured? You know, I've had to talk to you for like two minutes. Yeah, I'm sure. Time. Just think about. We are a private institution. Just think about you. You know, if you want to rest, premises. then that's fine. You know, I understand. Is it also policy to label certain students? I understand. I really do. For special intimidation tactics. How do you know about that designation? 
Perhaps the better question you should be asking yourself is, what else do I know? I'm sure we, uh, do not need to make so public an issue of your behavior today. But make no mistake, Miss Price. It's your choice, you know. Ooh, goody. I love cliffhangers. Funny, mm. just a couple years ago, something like that would have scared the crap out of me. These days, I'm at, like, the collegiate level of not giving any fucks. Thank you, thank you. As I say, you just take it easy and, you know, you're, you're welcome here. I say, everyone who I suppose is welcome here, you know. This makes being high sound like mm. a bad thing. Evan's work is actually pretty good. I'd never tell him that, of course. Oh, it's Victoria. Uh, Victoria Chase. Ah, oh, Carrie Price! It's Chloe. Oh, right. I'm just teasing. Hmm. People have been taking me Thank so you, seriously Fergus. since Thank I you. won the Beacon's Young Artist Award for my photography. You don't say. Between that and the Vortex Club, it's hard to keep people from putting me up on a pedestal or whatever. But you know all about that. What with Rachel Amber? Am I right? <laughs> you hang with the Vortex Club? I mean... I'm technically not a member, but I am being courted. I'm not sure The club I... should be a collection of Blackwell elites, but instead, it's some anti-bullying, hand-holding kumbaya shit. Not when I'm a senior. Hmm. Wow, the Young Artist Award. Oh, it's not a big deal or anything. Like, a hundred people submitted work, and my photography won. Congrats, I guess. So the beacon's putting me up on the front page of the lifestyle section. Who cares? <sighs> Wait. What about Rachel Amber? Rachel posted a slamming selfie of you two having the time of your lives. Do tell. Tell what, Victoria? It's a photo. Big deal. But it's on Facebook. I mean, <laughs> it's basically, on Facebook. You and Rachel are like BFFs. Mm. We're really not. Uh, so, what's she into? You know, what's her thing? Is it drugs? I'm not judging or anything. I figure if she's hanging out with you, she must be into some effed up shit. <laughs> you know? Seriously, I don't know why you're talking to me about Rachel. Oh, well, everybody loves her. Little Miss Perfect. So you're jealous of Rachel Amber. That's what's happening right now. Gotcha. Oh, God, I don't have time for this. I didn't hmm. even finish the chemistry assignment, and you're... As you. I say, guys, oh. if... Mm, oh, let's just walk away. Why would Rachel Amber ever hang out with Carrie Price? If you guys just want to chill, cold. then, you know... You... The future needs excellence. The future is an asshole. After episodes, I will, um, this episode, I will be going for a cigarette. Um, hey, Chloe. Hey, Samantha. What do you, you mean? know? Who's afraid of Virginia Woolf? I read that last year in Mrs. Hoyda's English class. I didn't think you did homework. <laughs> Normally I don't, but the play was actually good. What did you like about it? It's funny. Uh, the title's actually a play on the song Who's Afraid of the Big Bad Wolf? And that's funny? It is if you're the wolf. I'm not sure if you're joking. Sorry, I'm a little slow sometimes. I'm a little bitchy sometimes, so it's cool. People always say that, but I think you're actually... Sorry, Chloe. No one says anything like that. I don't know what I'm actually talking about. I bet. Hmm.
Chloe, I'd like to talk to you about wildfire awareness and prevention. Good morning to you too, Evan. According to the Department of Forestry, over 90% of this season's fires were caused by humans. That's a record high and completely preventable. Who says we should prevent fire? Fire <laughs> is awesome. While I realize you're being purposefully I'm sorry, Fergus. I'm sure that he will our local ecosystem benefit from fire. Knobcone pine cones, Did you text example, him? which require temperatures above 350 degrees to open. Say knob cone again. Yeah, probably Nick. It's fine. I understand. I understand, uh, this is for Colin, Nick. Right? I don't believe you actually care about this. My interest in fire prevention is completely sincere. Besides, I intend to get into college on the strength of my photography alone. Do you think Rachel Amber would be willing to pose for my portfolio? She's so artistic. I bet she would be a dream model. What do you think? I guess. I gotta run. Wait, one last thing. Will you sign my petition to have a fire safety assembly at school? Yeah, sure. sure. I love assemblies. Some of the best naps of my life. I don't know why, but it seems wow, to... Thanks. I did not see that coming. You being, you know, interested in complicated issues, helping out with the public. Do you want me to change my mind? I... No. How seriously am I taking this right now? Um... Smoke weed deep bear, huh? Happy to support such an important cause. Blackwell Academy. Home of tomorrow's leaders. I'm probably going to have to make a new Discord, you know. I'm going to probably have to... I don't know what's, what's going on. But yeah. Thanks so much for signing my petition. Smoke I don't know what D bear. Only you can prevent ganja fires. Um if I had known new discount uh, I would have told account you about my a it new a discord account potion wouldn't have worked skill challenge it's part of the tabletop game mm. we play who wouldn't understand I used to play with my friend Max it's been a long time though cool got my DVD one blade runner director's cut coming right up sweet Five bucks, right? Keep it. I'm just glad someone here appreciates the classics. You even asked for the director's cut, which took out the shitty voiceover and replaced it with a sweet dream sequence. Dream life over real life. That's my motto. Right on. Hey, do you know if Rachel's a gamer? Rachel Amber? You're asking me? Didn't you two go out last night, or was it just like a friend thing? Why do you want to know? <laughs> Steph has a crush. Chloe, you should join her game. Yeah, I don't have 50 hours right now. Thanks, though. We're at the end of the campaign, so it'll only take, like, 20 minutes? What else have you got to do before class? Uh, sure. What the hell? Game on, nerds. Here's a character sheet. You are an elf barbarian. <laughs> nice. I could totally see myself as an elf barbarian. I know. I'm good. All right. Let's get started. You were both famous heroes in the kingdom of Avernon, a once peaceful land now laid to waste by the bloodthirsty raiders of the Black Well. Alone, you have fought your way through the raider camps seeking their warlord leader, Durgaron. 
the hmm. unscarred. As you enter the final camp, bloodied and weary, you see your fellow hero approaching from the opposite direction. I raise my staff to you in greeting. I am Elamon, wizard of the Third Circle, foremost advisor to King Tiberius, and sworn defender of Averna. Introduce your character. Y yeah, okay. Uh, I'm an elf barbarian named... Uh... Calamastia. Calamastia. Super into it. Not bad. The two heroes... Hold on. Elamon narrows his eyes at the elf in front of him and says, I am here to defeat Durgaron, the Unscar. In the name of King Tiberius, what makes you think you are worthy to fight alongside me? I once stabbed a guy in the chest with a sword, and it went all the way through and killed the guy behind him, too. True story. You stand at a three-way crossing. To your left, the raiders' training ground. To your right, their prison camp. Straight ahead, an enormous, ostentatious tent that could only belong to Durgaron, the Unscarred. Which way do you go? Straight ahead, right? We're supposed to kill the Dur dude. Elamon frowns. The raiders could have some good loot at the training ground, and surely it is our duty to free all those prisoners. Your choice, newbie. Where do you wish to go? The prison Guess camp. It's time to free some peeps. Let's go to the prison camp. You behold a field of standing iron cages, each imprisoning hmm. a human villager, calling out for you to free them. Only a small, elderly dragonkin is keeping watch. He notices you, and in terror, runs into one of the few empty cages and locks himself in. Ah, uh, poor little guy. What's a dragonkin? Dragonkin are like little dragon people. They're assholes. I bet he has all the keys. Oh, okay. Hey, shit face! Get out of there! The dragonkin hops up and down, shaking his ring of keys at you. He shouts in a strange language. Whatever he's saying, probably isn't flattering. Got any useful spells in that robe of yours? Nothing that wouldn't blow up the cage and everything in it. Intimidate. That's a skill I have. Can I do that? I want the little bastard to shit his pants. You can try. What do you say? Listen up, you little lizard. Unfortunately, he doesn't speak common, which means he can't- I cast communication on the dragonkin. Shit. Really? Now he can understand every word you say. Time to work some real magic. So this is called a skill challenge, where you try to use- Oh, I know what this is. I grab the bars of the cage and lean in, nice and close. He steps back, his scaly skin quivering in fear. What do you say? I wiggle my hand. Hey, dragonkin guy. Want to become my meat puppet? How it works is I shove my arm up your ass into your head <laughs> and then I control your mouth from the inside to say things. Uh... He doesn't seem to like that idea. Neither do I. The dragonkin pleads with you. Please don't harm me, tall one. But I cannot give you key. Durgaron, much taller and meaner than you. Maybe we'll just wait here while you die of old age, dragonkin guy. He is undaunted. I will eat your face, elven Garbage lady. Elvin garbage lady? Eat my face. I'm trying. I twirl my axe around. Badass style. Eat yeah. this, lizard. How badass. Really badass. Seventeen. That's pretty badass. The... Dragon can cowers before you, looking left and right. He opens his jaws, and you think he's about to yell for help. I interrupt his yell by shoving my axe into the cage, pinning his head to the bars without hurting him. Then I say the following. This is going to be good. Here's what's up. 
I'm going to carve the skin from your bones. Then I'm going to turn your skin into a little leather handbag that I'll shove your skinless body into so I can carry it around with me wherever I go. That way, the next time some asshat refuses to give me a key I want, I can pull your body out and show them what happens. How does that sound? Uh, wow. That was nuts. I'm going to give you a plus 10 bonus to charisma. Go ahead and roll. A small pool of urine collects under the elderly dragonkin as, hands trembling, it hands you the keys. Then, it dies of fear. Awesome. Yeah! Go team! Why don't you start unlocking the prisoners? I'm on it. As you free them, the prisoners run away from you in fear. What's next? The training ground. That sounds good. Let's go to the training ground. Sweet. Upon arriving at the training ground, you are spotted by a heavy set orc who immediately shouts and points. There are a dozen raiders on the training field, all of whom raise their weapons and charge. Okay. So what do we do? I cast Urgle's Acid Blast. Um, overkill? Bam! You conjure up a wave of acid that washes over the charging orcs. Every raider suddenly starts screaming and writhing in pain. There's a sweet and sour kind of smell as the flesh melts off their bones like warm candle wax. Holy shit. You see why I haven't really needed a partner? The heavy set orc sergeant still remains. He runs at you swinging a massive warhammer. All yours. Okay, let's end this. Hmm. Cool guys, yeah, I'll probably You swing your yeah. great axe downward with both hands. The orc blinks, then splits open like a hot dog bun. Fuck yeah! I'm awesome at this game. It's going well. What about the loot? Well, as the training ground is now a roiling pit of acid, it's unlikely any loot survived. Dang. My character raises her axe. You'll pay for ruining all that loot, Elamon. By my honor, I apologize. Here, take this potion as a gift. Thanks, dude. What's next? It's tent time. You enter the tent to find Durgaron, warlord of the raiders of the Black Well, sitting comfortably at his throne. He's a huge red-eyed minotaur, swathed in a fine black cloak, gripping a two-handed sword that's easily six feet long. His laughter bellows. Wah, ha, 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 ha. Your lands and people are already mine. Your deeds here mean nothing. Your kingdom was weak. You are weak. What an asshole. I got this. I cast Zael's cataclysmic cone of fire. The fire fizzles out on contact. Durgeron laughs again, holding up his right arm to show off his bracer of fire immunity. Shit. All of my battle spells are fire-based. Except for, you know, Acid Blast, which someone used unnecessarily to show off for Chloe. Calamastia? What'll it be? <laughs> Holy shit! Uh, annihilation strike. That sounds boss as fuck. One? That's bad, right? Not for me. As you take your first step, you trip on a rock, collapsing onto the ground in a clangy jumble hmm. of metal. Your axe swings wildly to the side. Mikey, roll a reflex save. Huh. Oh, no. Three. Your axe strikes Elamon's leg. Um... <coughs> legs, <coughs> plural, severing both feet at the ankles. I am so sorry. Durgeron moves toward the crippled Elmon. Oh, shit! I told you this was my best boss. You didn't tell me my character might die. Durgeron approaches, stomping his bloody hooves. Stomp, stomp, stomp. This is all my fault. Sort of. What should I do? 
I say something really encouraging to Elamon. Like what? Yeah? Like what? Shit. Uh, why is being nice so hard? <clears throat> um, sometimes you have to get knocked down lower than you've ever been to, uh, hmm. stand up taller than you ever were. You just cut off my feet. Elamon feels inspired. He summons the strength necessary to crawl away from Durgeron. Okay. Durgeron has now turned his attention toward you. Bring it. He charges, thrusting madly with his great sword. Shit! Oh no. Your attempt to dodge his thrust fails. Durgeron laughs as he impales you on his blade, lifting you high into the air. Seriously? I can't do anything with that stupid bracer. I'm sorry, Chloe. Hey, I chopped your feet off. We're even. You feel your strength draining away as Durgeron lifts you higher into the air. It hurts like hell. What do you do? I bring my axe down onto his arm. The one with the fire bracer thingy. Oh, brilliant. You'll have to roll high to hit. You're almost dead. Twenty! Fuck yes! You bring your axe down in a wicked chop, severing his arm completely. His bracer of fire immunity clangs to the ground. I cast Gignomi's Fire Strike of Flame! Ooh, snap! Lying on the ground, you conjure a flaming spear, which flies from your hands to spear Durgeron in the chest, incinerating him completely from the inside out. Damn, Elamon. Durgron is defeated, but your wounds were too great. I'm afraid Calamastia is dead. No. I actually feel sad right now. Better to have died a hero than live as a coward. That was fun. Check out what I drew. Mikey's got serious drawing skills. Hmm. Glad you enjoyed it, Chloe. Yeah. I'll adventure with you anytime. <laughs> we'll see. Thanks for the game, nerds. DVD, check. Next stop, chemistry class. Joy. Time to go to school. Here, Twitch. Don't call me that. True North. A jock so dumb he makes jocks look bad. Guess Nathan Prescott made the shit list. Oh wow. This is some really weird crap, Prescott. It's not yours. Give it back. I hate that you're on the team now. You're such a loser. Wanna take this elsewhere, guys? The mute speaks? Whoa, whoa! You earn a spot on the squad, Twitch. You don't have your dad try to buy off the coach. At least my family pays tuition. How much financial aid does your deadbeat dad need again? Wow. Dick move, Nathan. My dad lost his job at the shipyard when your dad closed it down. And you want to talk shit to me? Leave Nathan alone! You know something, Prescott? I'm going to do you a favor. You can't be a part of the team and be into this stupid crap at the same time. You're a piece of shit. I am going stop to it. kill you. You guys, stop! Chloe, do something! Don't just stand there watching! What do you think, guys? Do you think I should step in or stay out of it? What do you think, Nanook? Nick, what do you think that I should do? <laughs> Stay out of it, okay. 
today. Mm. If you don't take the time to stand back and watch, you miss some of life's finer moments. Like... Booyah! That. <laughs> that took me months to put together! Quit the team, Twitch. Or next time it'll be worse. Go to hell. Thank you, Fergus. You should be ashamed. Flowers always make me think of springtime, which makes me think of summer, which makes me think of getting the fuck away from Blackwell for three whole months. I love flowers. Yeah, me too. I would sacrifice a goat to Jeremiah Blackwell himself if it meant I'd be leaving here in a month. That pick would actually make a sweet tattoo. Knowing Chloe, she would step in. Well, that's true. Oh, good. You're here. That's true, Resi. I do beseech you, chiefly that I, I might stepped in. in. My wow. What is your name? Miranda. Oh, my father, I have broke your hest to say so. Good. Admired Miranda. Indeed worth what's dearest in the world. Many a lady I have eyed with best regard. This is the Many first time, time I'm playing this. To... Uh, Rezzy, by the way. You know. The harmony of their tongues. <laughs> Hath I listened to you? <laughs> You're killing me. You've had weeks to be off book. Sorry, Mr. Keaton. No, don't apologize to me. Apologize to your scene partner who's been very accommodating and to your other fellow actors and most of all to yourself Mr. Keaton sorry to interrupt, but does this look better? I had my mom take it in a bit Rachel looks awesome This is getting as surreal as last night Looking good Rachel. Yes, yes, yes I have Rachel but I mean before the storm Mr. Keaton, I'm still having trouble with my affections are then most. I mean, this one I have before no the storm. To see a goodlier man. I mean, does she really mean that? Especially because I just straight out told her I've been banging all the ladies. <sighs> yeah, that is hard. We've talked about that line forever. We need a fresh perspective. The question is Are Miranda's feelings of instant passion for Ferdinand just inexperience in dramatic circumstances or. Has she actually just met the love of her life? What do you think? Miranda's an idiot because falling in love is stupid. What is just, she? Uh, just uh, episode one, the first actually, episode, Resi. So your point, whoever you are, about being an idiot or being naive is well taken. Thanks, Mr. Keaton. Later. See you later, guys. Oh, no. I have first period improv with a class full of freshmen now. Your eye looks fabulous. Where'd you get it done? Uh, what? <laughs> Just kidding. That asshole really clocked you. It wasn't a big deal. I'll just be a minute. Okay, so why am I here again? Oh, could you grab my belt for me? <laughs> I think it's in my bag over there. Yes, it's a shame that you didn't get to see yeah, her in yeah. in sure. uh, Life is Strange One. You know. Okay, uh, get the belt. Don't say any stupid shit, and don't. Hey now, sharing is caring. Hey now. 
sharing is care to internet or not to internet. I have feelings about <laughs> why do theater kids take themselves so seriously? That's the nicest back. Hello, Argus TV. Welcome, welcome to the stream. Rachel looks so happy here. Welcome in, buddy. There's Rachel's belt. Yeah, me too. It's the first time I'm playing this. So we'll give this like, uh. RA will suck as the first time I'm playing this, uh, if VC had any talent, maybe she would have gotten the before part. the storm. Talent, you know, is that what got Mr. K to mm. cast you, slut? Guess they don't call it Drama Lab for nothing. What to say, what to say. Slut shaming is so 2009. VC should know. Suck a D, VC. <laughs> if I'd known well, acting that you. to play with weapons, I I guess the Prescott donation doesn't cover this. Thank you, uh by the way, thank you. Rachel, is this your belt? Yes. <laughs> Thank you. I really liked your costume. Thanks. So, did you bring flowers for my dressing room? Uh, how about a hmm. belt instead? Perfect. I'll let you finish changing now. Chloe Price. <laughs> Rachel Amber. <laughs> Last night was amazing. You call getting attacked by goons amazing? I've got to hang out with you more. Deal. To tell the truth, I went to bed last night wishing it never had to end. But then I thought, why? Yo, Nathan. Why have to end? Welcome back, bro. Maybe it doesn't uh, have to end. Exactly. How would you like to join me on a little field trip? Ditch class. You mean it? Is that weird? No, it's awesome. Yeah, I'll be there, Nathan. I'll be there, I bro. I you'd say that. Now about that eye. That is a hell of a battle scar. Do you want me to cover it up with some makeup? Yeah, go yes, ahead. Yes, please. People won't shut up about it. Hold still. This is a lot of makeup. That's the price of valor. Close your eyes. Much better. Holy shit. Let's get the hell out of here. Yeah.
You sure you don't want to just grab the bus, or...? Nope. If we're gonna go rogue, we're doing it right. Well? What the hell am I getting into here? Where does this thing go? North? Maybe we'll end up in Seattle. Pull up a chair, Price. The view's amazing. Rachel wants me to pull up a chair. Guess we're not the first ones to hop on this train. I wonder what the symbol is. Whoa, Nathan's dad is a Terminator? That? I feel pretty confident mm. there's going to be a dead body in here. There's my chair. Things heavier than it looks. Guess I should sit down. Just another typical day, skipping school, with Rachel Amber. I was supposed to read Huck Finn in English last year. Now, Thank I'm you guys for the support, I really appreciate it by the way. Zero. I you see know. humans, but no humanity. Everybody is somebody, but no one wants to be themselves. <laughs> Some preachy graffiti up mm. in this train. All right, Chloe, you're on a freaking train. Okay, Fergus. Freaking Amber. Okay, that's Play fine. Cool. You know. I hope you sleep is this well. You know. Business? Is that what this feeling is? Wish Max were here so I could ask. Should I make small talk? Is that what people do? It's nice Rachel we're having. <laughs> what? I mean, thank weather. you. It's thank nice you, Frigus. <laughs> it sure is. Thank you so much. So, it's kind of weird that we're hanging out. You mean because I don't hang out with anyone and I don't have hmm. any friends? Yeah, and so do I, friends. Richard. Well, so I do I. Friend. Hmm. Singular. Her name is Max, hmm. but she left for greener, more <laughs> northern pastures. That sucks. Hmm. Hey, so... I want to say thanks. Hmm. For pulling you out of school? No, oh, dummy. Hmm. Thanks for last night. Ah. Uh, Yes, and Billy, yes. Billy's got PS5 now too, yes. Hmm. I owe you. That's for sure. Is that why hmm. you came along? Are you suggesting I should need a reason to ditch school? Yeah, at some point I will continue the, the quarry, Nick. Yeah. I will uh, play... Well, continue with the game, the okay? That's it? That's it. Good to fucking go. Anything beats another second in Blackwell. You really hate it there, don't you? You don't? <laughs> right. Thank you. I'm not sure if I'll play it tomorrow. Academy. I'll probably place uh, something you different tomorrow. But I definitely yeah. will play it. Let's do something fun. V card's been punched, Rachel. I'm sorry. Wow. Too far. Well, <laughs> I don't know. Uh, okay, something fun. I'm all ears. Two truths and a lie. What? I think 
We should play Two Truths and a Lie. It's a game where each person offers up three facts about themselves, two of which are the truth, and one of which is... A lie. Right. And then the other person has to guess which is which. Sounds fun. You're on. I'll start. First, I'm ambidextrous. Second, I was born in New York, the land of fashion and Broadway, to which I will one day return when my heinous exile here in Arcadia Bay comes to an end. New York, huh? I've never been. Not a world traveler? Not yet, at least. If you could travel anywhere, where would you go? Russia, Greece, Kathmandu? Kathmandu? One day, I'm going to climb Everest. And I thought moving away from Arcadia Bay was ambitious. Ooh, what's your third thing? My third thing? Two truths and a lie. You say three things. Right. I'm a Leo. Meow. Okay. <laughs> so, ambidextrous, born in New York, and a Leo. Hmm, what gotcha. do you guys think? So... Which is the lie? Hmm. What do you guys think? I may be thinking Leo, but what do you guys think? What do you think, uh, Nick? Uh, okay, I'll try it. You're way too lucky to be a Leo. You've got to be a Sagittarius or something. The Archer? That'd be cool. Like Artemis. But I'm afraid I was telling the truth. Wow. Seriously? Hear me roar. <laughs> no, the lie was New York. I've never been there. Though I want to one day. Okay. I was born in Long Beach. New York's on the bucket list then. Sounds good. It's fine. It's okay. fine. Your turn, Price. First fact. Right. Something mm. about myself. Should I start things off with a lie or with the truth? Or should I cheat? Let's see mm. how good she yeah. really is at this game. Ah, uh, thank you, Steve. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, buddy. When I was a kid. No, it makes me want to throw up. Literally. That's... Weird. Thank you, buddy. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, uh... Thank you, uh, no Steve. I my hand punching Stephanie Kowalski in fifth grade. No way. Bitch took my yoo -hoo. Knocked her the fuck out. I see you like to write notes to yourself. Helps me stay focused. Also, sweet scar. I used to want to be a pirate when I grow up. I kind of still do. Arr. You're hella mysterious, Chloe Price. Uh, hmm, really? <laughs> Who says that? It's a Cali thing. Anyway, I think I have your number. I'm not sure why country music makes you throw up. I'm a complex girl, Rachel. And I think it's probably true. Also, I kind of like the Dixie Chicks. You and David both. No accounting for taste. Who's David? He's just... some asshole. Who likes the Dixie Chicks? He's an asshole my mom's dating, I guess. And you don't like him. <laughs> it's still so... Oh, thank you for weird. letting me, uh... She's dating someone. My dad and my mom... <laughs> okay, totally Nick. Alone. Well, thank you. you tell how fucked thank you for being here. Thank you. Settling for David. 
And thank you for telling me that, Richard. Thank you. Jagoff type. Like the opposite of my dad. Oh, that sucks. Yeah. David has no respect. He acts like I'm some kind of problem to solve. Sometimes I am a problem, though. That's a load of bullshit. What do you mean? You're not a problem, Chloe. You're a person. It sounds like the only problem is David. You need to hit him where it hurts. <laughs> the only thing that David loves has four wheels and a four-barrel carburetor. <laughs> oh, God. A muscle car? I'm probably going to steal it soon, so... Hmm. Let me know if you need an accomplice. Of course you wanted to be a pirate. Sail the open seas. Buckle swash. Plunder secret treasure. Did I mention my love of booty? <laughs> so, pirate. Obviously true. Maybe you'd like to be my first mate. Oh, are you accepting applications? Considering it. Now, about this broken hand story. It's not that I don't think you could knock Stephanie Kowalski out. A bitch takes your yoo-hoo, she's gotta get got. Damn straight. But, you didn't get that scar from punching someone. No. Right, that scar okay. Is from a distal radius fracture. So you're a physician now. Last summer I performed a one woman Dr. Who mm. homage entitled Weeping Angel. I'll go and Wait, stop by what anyway. Is, I'll go and stop I know that by. The scar you've got comes with breaking your wrist when you fall. Like, from a skateboard? Yeah. I guess. six years ago? Seven. Well, shit. I always thought I was a good liar. Good thing you're pretty. Tuh. So, if my math is correct, you told me two truths and one lie. What? Yep. You expected me to cheat? Winners make their own rules, Chloe. You are crazy good at this game. A lifetime of studying the human condition. Well, I'm impressed. I bet it's hard to impress Chloe Price. I'm gonna feel good about that one. When your dad is the district attorney, I guess lying is... something you're used to. Seriously? Seriously. I know who to call if I need to get out of a ticket then. Not that I have a right of my own. Car first. Embarrassing hmm. number of moving violations second. Hey. Thanks for trusting me. Trusting you? You played the game. And not everyone would admit to wanting to be a pirate. But eye patches are so cool. And rum is delicious. Also, you told me about that dickwad David. Now he's on my shit list too. Hell yeah. Mustache brain won't know what hit him. I guess. You opened up a lot. That's all. It's not a big deal. I hate to break it to you, but Chloe Price is not exactly renowned throughout Arcadia mm. Bay as a bastion of trust and empathy. Trust doesn't exactly come easy to me. Maybe if you'd had my life, you'd understand. No, I get that. On the other hand, I got on this train with you, didn't I? Fair point. Wouldn't mind listening to some music. Hey, want to listen?
cool mm. bracelet. I've had it, I guess, since I was a kid in Long Beach. It reminds me that there's more to experience out there than just Arcadia Bay. Maybe one day I'll go back to Long Beach. Or anywhere but here. Maybe sooner than later. Me too. Arcadia Bay can suck a bag mm. of dicks. Sometimes I feel like I've got no reason to stay. Don't be surprised, Chloe, if one day I'm just out of here. Let me know if you need an accomplice. Check it out! We're here! What? Where is here? Jump and find out! Did you say jump? Jump! Um... Fuck it! Hmm. All right. I'm just going to go for a cigarette now, okay? Um... Just gonna go for a quick cigarette now. I'll be right back, guys.
Hello everyone, I'm back. Sorry about that. Hey, Rosie. Hello. <sighs> welcome, welcome to the stream. How are you doing? I hope you're doing and a um, reward for making it up here. I hope you I have, have a to play. Another one. I like games. Deal with it. This is what I learned in theater class. It's all about improvisation. So far, what I've learned about you is that you're into acting, lying, and playing games. What's your point? By the way, I'm so not blue. Full of oh, okay. Full of shit. I'll make I'll make you blue now, okay? Let me know when you figure out which one. This game make, involves spying now, on okay. people from afar. Luckily, we've got some there you go. surveillance equipment right here. Mm. Let's fire it up. You're welcome. You're welcome. That blows. Well, shit. That was my last quarter. You? Quarterless. Damn. Hey, maybe I can MacGyver something up. I've been told I'm pretty handy. Oh, yeah? Hmm. Let's see what you got. Rachel really wants to use this viewfinder. I'd love to get it working for her. This whole day is out of order, but in the best possible. Damn, that's an old tree. Wait, does this... The lonely oak looks lonely. Guess even trees have outcasts. Looks like this one might actually be working. Dwight Mueller really killed it with this statue of an explorer guy. Where are all my explorer ladies at, though? Hmm. If Max were here, she'd probably take a black and white photograph and call it. Innocence lot. I've always said the Prescott family has a couple screws loose. Yuck. Cliche much, AW mm. and OL. I've been saying sorry all morning. I admit it was really dumb to lock the keys in the car. You've been on me for three hours. My hierarchy of needs goes pot, then beer, then wine. Still, wino has a classy ring to it. Hey, spare Angel, some hey. Sorry, we might have some leftover food when we're done. Hello, Angel. No, I'm not. <clears throat> what kind of thing? This place has really gone downhill. Shh. Meow. <laughs> <laughs> What's worse than groveling for change? Sorry, groveling I'm late. Oh, no. no worries. No worries. 
It's fun. There's got to be something freeing about being able to build your home wherever you are, from whatever is around you. My hierarchy of needs goes pot, then beer, then wine. Still, why no? Whoa, that's badass. Yep, it's official. I'm learning way more ditching school than I ever do in class. Rachel's quarter is still trapped in there, waiting to be... Huh. Looks like I might be able to pry it open with the right tool. I'm not getting in there with just my fingers. Maybe Rachel has something I can use? Uh, I'm thinking about prying open that viewfinder. Got a knife on you? A knife? Yeah. My mom took mine. Uh, no. How about a nail file? I guess you could stab someone with a nail file. Oh, right. Sh sure, let's try it. Mm -hmm. How did you sleep, Angel? Always looks so easy in the movies. I wonder if I can find something sturdier to use. This Blackwall guy sure liked founding stuff that was already there. Founders keepers, I guess. Wait. Is that the same AW as before? Not afraid of commitment, I see. I guess nature doesn't quite provide. Get out of here, woodland creatures. Have some self-respect. Hello, Daisy. Ah, uh, don't be sorry. It's fine. Get out of here, woodland creatures. Mm. Have some mm. self-respect. It's fine. It's fine. Thank you. Thank you for... Thank you for uh, stopping by. Thank you. This trash can is in pretty high demand. I'm gonna need a bigger prior majigger. And how how were you doing? How how were you, Daisy? What then? What do I uh, have to get? I don't want to head down there just yet. Totally gonna get you that quarter. Love the confidence. Would love a quarter even more.
Looks like this one might actually be working. It's not gonna work. I need to find something else. What though? Hey Laura, welcome back. How was your uh Is there anything metal around here? How was your dinner? Uh, welcome back, uh, by the way. Ah, uh, nice. If Max were here, she'd probably take a black and white photograph and call it Innocence Law. Ah, you fools. It was lovely. What did you have? I guess nature doesn't quite provide. Oh, okay. Stealing a dedication plate takes persistence. <laughs> Welcome back, guys, and everyone, you know. Rush got power, activate. Yo, Sergeant Gaming, how you doing? That was enough of a game for me. Your MacGyver skills are second to none. Except, probably, hmm. MacGyver. Great, man. Thanks for asking. That's good. Well, thank you for stopping by the stream. Thank you. Rachel smells like... Jasmine? Is she smelling me right now, too? Mm. I should have showered this morning. I bet it was lovely, right? All right. Here's the game. You find some people for us to spy on, and then you and I will act out what they're saying and thinking. That's it? I do that in my head during, like, every class. See? You're a natural. Let's give it a try. Hey, what do you say we barbecue some squirrels when we're done here? God! Well, thank you for being life. here, Lola. They totally stole my third grade art project. Wow, you made that? Can't you tell? Well, you thank, you. thank you. Thank you for... Thank you. Mm. All right. Let's see. Why do we always hold hands like this? Didn't you tell me you were ambidextrous? No, I didn't. I said I was ambisexual. Oh, so you can have sex with both of your hands? Exactly. Mm. Wanna see? Only if you let go of my hand first. <laughs> <laughs> Hmm. What's going on with these two? If you want lunch, you're going to have to learn how to skin your own food like a man. But I don't know how to skin a bald eagle, Dad. You don't? What the <laughs> hell are they teaching you in school? Wow. That was dark. Too dark? Perfect dark.
Loving this guy. What's he thinking right now? <laughs> no matter how fast I go, I'll never outwalk this wedgie. That's so tragic. <clears throat> oh, so beautiful in its own way. <laughs> This is fun. Who's next? Oh, sorry. Didn't mean to hog the viewfinder. Ooh, jackpot. Commence makeout session in three, two, one. Nailed it. Damn, they are really going at it. Oh, honey, I think we used the vibrating bed for too long. I'm totally seeing double. <laughs> Rachel? Hey. Are you hey, you Samantha. Right? Are Welcome. You? Excuse me? Welcome in. Checked, you're supposed mm. to be Chloe Price. Yet we've been ditching now for hours, and we haven't even gotten wasted yet. That's got to be against some school ditching rule. Uh, hell yeah. The honor student wants to show the school delinquent how to party? Be my guest. How gracious of you. Thank you, okay, Angel. Have a bottle of wine. Let's steal it. Uh, okay. Or we could go try to find a liquor store instead. No. You shouldn't bring alcohol to a public park if you're not willing to share it with everybody, right? And... Fuck it. I just want to take something that's not mine. All right. I'm going in. Try to keep up. Um, can we help you? Oh my god! Holy shit! Talk about committing to a performance. Better act back. Oh, thank god! Please, this girl is in trouble! Go get help! I need to get these two to focus on Rachel so I can swipe the wine. What are you waiting for? Go! I, I've, I've seen this kind of thing before. This woman clearly has a wound that needs to be sterilized. Do you happen to have any alcohol? I didn't see a... No. <laughs> Rachel? Sorry, I have to rewind that part. Hey, are you alright? Are, are you good, you? Samantha? Excuse me? Last I checked, you're supposed to be Chloe Price. Yet we've been ditching now for hours, and we haven't even gotten wasted yet. That's got to be against some school ditching rule. Uh, hell yeah. The honor student wants to show the school delinquent how to party? Be my guest. How gracious of you. They have a bottle of wine. Let's steal it. Uh, okay. Or we could go try to find a liquor store instead? No. You shouldn't bring alcohol to a public park if you're not willing to share it with everybody, right? Amber's dad. And fuck it. I just want to take something that's not mine. Hmm. All right. I'm going in. Try to keep up. Um, can we help you? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh Try God. get some rest, as I say. Try get some rest, okay? Holy shit. Talk about committing to a performance. 
Better act fast. What, what do we do? And the Should Oscar for balls? best distraction of wine toting picnickers goes to Rachel Amber. Better play my supporting role and grab the wine life? fast. Yeah, I guess I'd remember something like that. So <laughs> I'm I will oh I'm dreading tomorrow. Please, What's going on tomorrow? Go get help. I need to get these two to focus on Rachel so I can swipe the wine. Who are you waiting for? Go. I uh, I I already called 911. They they should have an ambulance here any moment. In the meantime, they said to keep close watch on her. Like turn all the way around and really focus. Watch out. I'm going to check her pulse. That's on her neck, right? I still think you should go get help. There's a ranger station on the other side of the park. Good point. We'll keep watch while you go. Uh, uh look at all the time we've wasted already. I'm sorry. This woman needs mouth -to -mouth I'm really sorry. Stat. Uh, Why don't you just no. not go? Yep. Definitely needs mouth to mouth. Okay, okay, you can do Why this. Why do you just not go? I can't do it. Pathetic. Look, he's clearly useless. This woman needs help from someone who actually knows what they're doing. Hey, look at me. Do you want to be locked out of the car of life forever, or are you ready to break in there and seize the someone's keys to birthday? Your we're forced. Oh my God, you're right. <sighs> I'm really sorry. Hey, wow. I'm all better now. You saved my life. From the bottom of my heart. Thank you. Yeah. Good work, everyone. Peace out. I'll still text. That was incredible. Hmm. You're a hero. Okay. Huh. Okay, that's I fine. Yes, I, I am. Hmm. You know, I'm only just going to do the one episode today, guys. Like, you know, I'll just do one episode. Here, you earn this. Hmm. Thanks. <laughs> I could use a drink after trying to keep up with... What was it? Two, yeah, two hours, yeah. Two and a half hours or two hours 40 or whatever. I'm excessively sober right now. Hmm. Right. Okay. Guess we're leaving now. Hmm. I love you guys, by the way. Thank you for the support and everything. You know, I really appreciate it. Thank you. Whoa. Hey, check this out. What? Thank you, Angel. Great. It's a pile of trash. Uh, yeah. An awesome pile Thank of trash. Thank you, Angel. Let's explore. You have fun, Chloe. I'm gonna go sit down. Thank Rachel's you, Laura. Rachel's acting kind of standoffish ever since we left the park. What's her deal? Thank you so much.
Chloe, I'd really like some space right now. I'm born lost. Well, you know where I am if you need me. Okay. You know where I am Actually, if you need me, okay? No. I thought we were having a great day together. Why are you acting like this all of a sudden? I'm not acting like anything. I just want to be left alone right now. No. I don't understand. You can't just turn on me for no reason. I'm sorry. Turn on you? I guess I forgot. It's always about how you feel, isn't it? Sad Chloe's fucking sad again. Maybe you should try giving a shit about other people for once. Are you serious right now? Fuck! Uh... Okay, I still have no idea what's going on with Rachel, but apparently she gets smashy when she's angry. I can work with that. You're welcome. You're welcome. Score. Here. If you really want to smash something, this should do the trick. I asked you to leave me alone. Are you kidding me? I, I know you're the school princess and all. With the DA daddy and the perfect grades and all the perfect little Victoria chases kissing your perfect ass. But seriously, fuck you. Great. I'm leaving. See you around, Chloe. You can't leave! Watch me. Rachel, wait! Don't go! Why not? Because, because I don't want to ruin this the way I ruin everything else in my life. And what is this exactly? I mean, fuck, are you actually going to make me say it? Say what exactly? You know, like, a friendship. They should, yeah, they would be good. It would more. be good. Ah. Uh, it you would know, be good if they made weird, it. Right. It's like just, life is strange film. It was the best day I've had since Cuz they've made Uncharted. Since my dad died. And when I almost ruined it just now, the way I ruin everything, it made me realize <laughs> whatever's going on between us is special. Come on. Hey, Miss Girl. Welcome. Chloe, I'm sorry. How I'm are you? Really, How are you doing? Really sorry. But I can't. I can't. Even though I want to. Why not? Because I can't. I know it isn't fair, but it's how it is. I'm good. I'm I'm doing I'm doing good. How's your weekend so Goodbye, far? Chloe. How was your weekend so far? Uh by the way. Oh, poor Chloe. Yes. Going good so far. Good, good. Fuck I'm happy to hear this that. Place.
You know she's fake, yet you can't take your eyes off her. Who else do I know who fits that description? Yeah! Fuck off, Rachel. If you want to rip a family apart from the inside, it's important to bring the proper tools. Fuck you, David. I've never understood your hard on for cameras, Max. You took a million pictures of us, and not one of them showed that you were gonna leave when I needed you most. Fuck cameras. What's she seen, or...? Dad. Dad? Oh, no. So upsetting. Chloe. She back in the car with her dad again? crying sweetheart because you're not real <laughs> I'm not what is going on what's past is prologue and shit. she's having a flashback right you know, look on the bright side would ya what bright side you made a new friend today. And she's wearing a different t-shirt as well. I guess I did that. 
Gotta say, that was some fight. A lover's quarrel, you might say? <laughs> she nearly took your head off. What do you care? Sorry, sweetheart. I guess I'm getting into your personal business. I don't feel drunk. Sometimes, people need you, though. Even when they don't admit it. Wow. Rachel. Okay. Life is definitely strange, guys. <laughs> So a long, it's a long episode, guys. So I've gone by three hours. Welcome back, Richard. Thank you, thank you for, thank you for joining back. You came. I'm glad. Hey. I couldn't let the day end with whatever this afternoon was. Chloe, I want to talk to you about something, but I don't know how to talk about this. You don't have to tell me anything you don't want to. You remember that guy that we saw under this tree with that woman? The ones who were making out? That was my dad. Oh, all right. Wow, really? And that woman was definitely not my mom. Oh, the worst part is. <laughs> wow, wow, wow. I felt like my dad's been lying about something for a while. I just. I didn't know what it was. <laughs> So when I saw he got a text from an unknown number asking him to meet, I thought I thought I could catch him or something. I'm so sorry, Rachel. Wow. I don't I don't know what to say. Neither do I. Chloe, I love my dad. I love him. And 
I never want to see his fucking face again. When my dad died, I was so mad at him. For months, I felt wrong because half the time I thought of him, I wanted to scream. And the other half, I forgot. Forgot that anything had changed. It's silly, but I've carried this photo around with me for years. It's from Mount Hood. My dad took me hiking there when I was 10 and it started raining and I fell and broke my arm three miles from the car. I remember screaming like I was gonna die, but my dad, he carried me down the mountain. Hmm. I still remember the smell of his coat and how calm he was and the sound of his voice and... He was just so strong, you know? I, I felt safe. You trusted him? Completely. Here. Chloe, I owe you an apology. Hey, we were both kind of the queen of shitty. No, I mean it. Whatever's going on between us, it's intense mm. and new and awesome. And you had the courage to tell me that you feel it too. And I treated you like shit. Courage? I don't know if I'd call it that. More like blind hmm. desperation. And maybe a slight buzz from that wine. I just want you to know... I'm lucky... Mm -hmm. that you were with me today. You're a badass, Chloe Price. What? Remember that biker asshole who wouldn't let you into the mill? You talked your way right past him. You saw that? And those skeevy douchebags who followed you upstairs? You dropped that one guy with a bottle to the face. Only because you showed up at the last minute and... See? <laughs> You're the real thing, Chloe. I don't know anyone like you. Plus, you came along with me, no questions asked. Well, I don't really need a good reason to ditch school. I guess tomorrow there'll be hell to pay. My mom might skip grounding and just go straight to the death penalty. And my dad will definitely punish me with... I'm so sorry, Rachel. Fuck him. What I wouldn't give to leave this place and never look back. What's stopping us? Us? Are you serious? There's nothing keeping me here. Not anymore. So, if I came to you tomorrow and told you to pack your bags... I'm serious. Let's do it, mm. Chloe. Let's yes. leave this place forever. Okay. Let's do it. Let's move and never come back. I borrow your lighter? Thank you. Hmm, she's gonna burn the photograph, huh? She's putting the past behind her. Hmm. Wow. 
Done. That's crazy, man. Yeah, you can't hear anything because I turned the music off. I'm sorry, guys. Worst timing, my leg kind of ached. Oh no. I'll be st I'll be finishing streaming in a minute. I'll come talk to you, okay? Yeah. As I say, you can't hear anything now because the music. And of course, I turned it off so I don't get copyright. You attacked, you were mean to Joyce. Well, yeah. You stayed thing. Oh, well. Yeah, true, true. No. Yeah, so that was that. So I will play the other another time. Uh, thank you for being here with me, guys. Um, I'll see you all tomorrow for another stream. I love you all and peace out.